Thanks for viewing uh, machinery video. This 1965 Lucas horizontal boring mill, the machine has 48 inches vertical, 72 inches cross, and 54 inches of saddle travel. I want to show how nice the crossways on the saddle are. Um, I'm can see the thatch marks from grinding here. This machine has references to it being completely remanufactured in the mid 80s apparently. And while well, that's some time ago, the machine is just in really superior condition. So I wanted to get a different angle on the crossways of this machine because they are really in excellent shape, not a scratch, not a score, and they actually have a mirror finish. So here we're getting a shot of the Lucas 441D72 uh, headstock feeding down. the traverse of the machine and uh, everything on this machine operates correctly and smoothly. While the saddle ways and the cross ways on the Lucas machine are both hardened, the vertical ways are soft. These were flaked to retain more oil and I have a good tight shot of that flaking and I'm going to pull back to show that the vertical ways on this machine are just in real nice shape. There is no scoring whatsoever. They uh, are in really good repair. So currently we are uh, seeing the spindle feed out. Four inch diameter spindle, maximum RPM of 1550. So, right now, what we're going to do is show the 50 taper power tool lock, eject the tool, and uh, go ahead and really firmly lock that tool in. And there you have it. So we're going to run through some spindle speeds on the Lucas 441B72. And this is the slowest speed on the machine. This is 13 RPM. This is 77 RPM. This is 114 RPM. Three hundred and five RPM. This is 453 RPM. 453. Uh, it's worth uh, just to mention uh, with this Lucas machine that as well as having uh, oil metered in the headstock, it also has uh, oil misted 
in the headstock and what you're seeing is oil vapor and I reviewed some of the video and to me it looked at, like it could be discerned as smoke and um, I would hate to have that be uh, seen that way. Um, you can see in the sight glass that there's great oil return and uh, so that is the situation with our uh, oil vapor in the headstock. This is 692 RPM, 692. This is 833 RPM, 833. Starting to hear that spindle brake work real uh, well. This is a thousand twenty seven RPM, thousand twenty seven. Upon this pendant, they put a three-axis Fagor uh, digital readout display. Sometime throughout its career, uh, it lost one access display, and they fixed that uh, by putting up another box. So uh, this unit does, in fact, read three axes. The uh, three-axis digital readout system is functional. So uh, this is the pendant for the uh, Lucas machine and we just uh, gave it a little refurbishment with a new tool eject uh, switch there and uh, the pendant is in real nice shape and fully functional ready for many years of service. I have a real tight shot here of the saddle ways in and out and uh, they are just as nice as the crossways, um, really without a score at all, good shape. We're going to go ahead and run the uh, saddle and uh, table and feed and wrap it.
table on this Lucas machine is 42 by 74. This machine is available to be inspected under power in the greater Cleveland area by appointment. And as always, thank you and please visit www.wigglesworth.com.